So this digger has done an enormous amount of work on this house and for the most part it's not needed too many repair jobs or too much maintenance but it's now got these really nasty cracks on the boom which if they get any bigger might affect the alignment for the pins which would be a really complicated and probably expensive repair job. So before that happens we're going to take it all apart, give it a good clean and see if we can figure out a way to fix it now. Whites on this.
That's very bad. Remarkable. Can you bring the burner? Please? So this is the reason why we're taking this apart. Just gently. So we took two rams off the digger. This was the bottom ram and this was the top ram. And on the bottom ram, we had a perished rubber ring that was basically letting debris into the hydraulic system and also letting hydraulic fluid out. That's why we've taken it apart. And we were left with all of these seal bits and pieces, which you can't reuse. So we've now got a new seal kit in after getting the wrong one by accident. We've got to reassemble all of these parts, apart from this one, which, because it's such hard plastic, you need a special tool to get this one in. So we're probably gonna to have to take this to a specialist mechanic, but all the others, we should be able to get in ourselves. And then these were the pivot pins. Some of them were in quite bad condition, particularly this one. Two seemed okay. So we made a big order, which has finally arrived, which includes a bunch of new brass bushings, four new teeth for the bucket, and the bolts. These are the pivot pins that we need to replace. And then we also got the king post pin, because as you saw, there was a really bad repair job, which was just spot welding and then grinding, which we had no idea about. We bought it like that, which is a bit of a shame. And we're not gonna install this yet because we wanna use the digger this summer, but we've bought it just so that when we do come round to sort in that king post out, we'll have it ready to go.
many months later. So we also bought a few of these brass bushes to replace some of the older ones, such as this. And just from eyeballing it, it doesn't look like the hole is lined up with the nipple, which is possibly why we were getting a lot of wear on the pin. As we suspected, this wasn't lined up properly.
It's not a perfect JCB yellow, but it's as close as we're gonna get. And I think JCB have a patent on their color. So that's why it's so expensive and so hard to get hold of. So now everything's painted, all the bushes have been changed. So the final step is to replace all of these seals. So stuff like this isn't gonna be put back in because that's obviously completely useless now. As I mentioned at the beginning, this kingpin 
has been repaired and obviously needs replacing because it's very likely that this the kingpin has been wearing on this king post and it might need to go away to get reamed so we're going to hold off with that for the moment there are two bushes that go around the kingpin so we've got two new ones of them but that's a job for another day Still got bloody oil dripping down my neck. Yeah, you won't. You've got to be careful, yeah. We're, we're gently.
very happy with how the dig is now working. It's a lot smoother to use, there's way less juddering about, which is nice. We're also really happy with this repair job. It's probably even stronger now than it was when we bought it. And I think it will last quite a lot longer, even though the color is not a perfect match, who really cares? And this bottom round we seem to be having a small problem with, it, it's quite slow on the up. Uh, on the down it's fine, the hydraulic fluid's coming out as quick as anything, but it's just on the up, it's quite slow. Um, and it does seem to be getting quite hot up here. So if any hydraulic experts can advise, please do let me know in the comments. Nice to finally have some decent teeth on the bucket. And then we've got little bits and pieces like replacing these lights. And then we've got that big job of doing the kingpin and getting this king post reamed out. But, but we'll probably wait until we've got a big chunk of time where we're not gonna be using the digger because knowing the system here, it will take a couple of months at least. But thank you for watching and see you next time.